I made it to Ian's. Nate and I are gonna help him out clean out his new shed, or his new shop, I guess. How long has it been sitting, you think? Three years. Three years? Yeah. But this is the rig we're throwing all the junk in. Do a donut! Oh, we got a new grill. A grill? Yeah, fresh in the bag? Yeah, fresh in the bag. That's good. Woo! We're gonna have to open that in a bit. Check her out. Hashtag score. Oh, it's what the heck, oh, man? That's no. not new. Oh, shit. You got the receipt? Is the receipt in there? Oh, so. <laughs> ain't no good. Oh, oh man, we can't even cook on it. Oh. What the hell? That's it's junk. Drunk. You. Gross. Oh, there's dead ones in there. Dead ones? Yeah, look at the tail. <laughs> oh, yuck. Yeah. Yeah, yep, going outside. Yeah, it's definitely going outside. Yep, yep. Scrap steel pile. So we got the metal pile over here. I like I like your ride. I like your wheels. Yeah, that's what we're gonna Hey, we found a brand new grill. Do you wanna check it out? Oh, that's a nice little bench there, Ian. We're gonna keep it. I would say so. Any other mice or moles or anything else? Any wildlife? Teamwork makes the dream work. Next we're gonna clean out my bedroom. Hey, holy boy. That worked. <laughs> Nate, we totally gotta ride those things. Let's go. Let's make it happen, Gavin. I don't think we're heavy enough to make this thing do a wheelie. Maybe if you help us by popping the clutch. No, jeez. I knew I came for a reason. We gotta go back. So you want this moved? Yeah. So we can't ride it no more? No. Ah. Oh. Alright, Nate, maybe after lunch. <laughs> Ian popped the clutch on us. We fell off. There goes the first load of I got a free 4x4 from Ian. I love free 4x4s. Don't know what I'm gonna do with it, but you know. Ian, you ready for dinner? Yeah, I'm ready for dinner. Nate, are you hungry? Oh, starving. Starving Marvin? <laughs> We're in New York, we're off the grid though. Look at the stairs I'm walking down. I have no hands because I have a tripod. Holy smokes, that's what we just came down. Look at these rocks. And the trees just live right on the edge, like literally. Do bears live in here? Probably. Like bears can totally live up here. What if one's just chilling and we walk up on them? You ain't gonna know we're in a bear. This is a slippery log. Holy smokes. It's pretty tight. Jeez. That's crazy. This is crazy. Have we crossed that bridge yet? Yeah. We have? Mm -hmm. Really? So is this the staircase that I'm like, hey, can we go down here? Probably. Around here no, this looks like it's a dead end. Do Look at how skinny it is down there. They lost a bridge. Yeah. One, one of the bridges fell down here. How many people do you think climb up in here? Probably a lot. Probably. I totally brought the wrong shoes though.
That was easy for you. <laughs> now when you're six foot one or two, whatever the hell I am. What a fall. Yeah, that's called a jump. Yeah, so from this point on, I don't really know where we're going, so I guess we're just gonna go on a little adventure. Oh, that, that's good. You got a map though, right? Like, wait a minute, Get look at this. This is so fascinating. Holy smokes. Jump from there to there. No! I'm gonna jump it from there to there. Oh my god, that looks like it's hard to This one looks a little sketchy. See, I can't believe now, today, when everybody's always like, oh, I got dirty, oh, I got hurt. I can't believe something like this isn't shut down. Like, we can't even play dodgeball in school anymore because too many people got hurt. You make it look so easy. Should I go up here? If you fall, I can't reach you. If I fall, I'm SOL. Yeah, if you better. Actually, F U C K E D. Yeah. I don't know how I, how I would get down. Yeah, let's just come back down. I think I just discovered I might be afraid of heights. All right, now I'm a little freaked out. I could keep going though. Should I keep going? No, you should come back down. You're really high up. <laughs> How'd I get up here? Right here? You climbed from the side, yeah. There we go. That was, uh, that is an adrenaline rush. Mm -hmm. That's for sure. Do you see the sign? Yeah. I was just like way up there. I thought you were supposed to climb them. You're not? The glaciers did a beautiful job constructing this place. Excellent. Phenomenal. Now you've lived next to these things for two years and this is our first time coming here. First time. Well, we gotta come here more often. Okay. Do they have it open in the winter? I can't imagine so, it's slippery enough without snow and ice. <laughs> this place is absolutely beautiful. We've been here for probably 30 minutes. Climbed a lot of rocks. This is my first time, so I didn't know that you're not supposed to climb the rocks, but I'm not bragging or anything, but I feel like, well, how, how would you say that? I, I think I'm coordinated enough to not fall or get injured because I think that's what they're afraid of. If you're uncoordinated, stay the hell off the rocks. This thing's very cool though. I get it. I forgot to mention the first five minutes we were here, we didn't climb anything, we weren't running, we weren't horse assing around. And I dropped you guys, my brand new camera. Brand new. Luckily no damage. I don't know how, it fell on a rock. That's why I got a three year warranty. Just to put it into perspective. Those are some big rocks. How's it going? He's <laughs> just chillaxing. Honey, I don't think you're supposed to be out of here. Do we got a runaway go? <laughs> Look at the little black and white one. Oh my god. Hi, honey. He totally escaped. He totally escaped. He's just chilling. Yeah.